What's going on guys? Today I'm gonna to show you how to make a cinematic Instagram story in three minutes. All right, one of my favorite things to do lately is to create fun Instagram stories and it's really easy to do and anybody can do it. So for the first step, you wanna grab a camera. For this example, we're gonna use the iPhone because a lot of people have phones and it's an easy camera to grab. Now the key is to film vertically. I know a lot of us are used to the horizontal look. Well, guys, time's changing. We're looking at phones, they're up and down. Let's rotate 90 degrees and start shooting. You don't need to go crazy and start overthinking. You wanna take it easy. My motto for this is document, don't create. Think of something cool you're doing like making eggs in the morning and go and shoot it. We're gonna get into transitions and other fun things like that in future videos, but for now, we're just looking at the basic story. Now here's a tip, try shooting slow-mo. I love 120 frames per second and a lot of the new iPhones can do this. It stabilizes your footage beautifully. You can give a nice soft pan and your shots will look gorgeous. Check out this side-by-side -side right here. You can see me using the iPhone in the example and you can see the iPhone footage there. It looks absolutely marvelous. Guys, try this, your videos are gonna look awesome. So the next step is editing. You wanna load that footage onto your computer, no need to transcode or anything, let's just bring it right into Adobe Premiere and we're gonna start sequencing it out the way the shots are intended to be. Now the key here is to make your sequence 1080 by 1920. This is the rotated version of what we would normally see, 1920 by 1080. You wanna rotate all your footage and scale it so that it's standing up and down just like we shot it. Now the other thing about editing is IG stories, they can only be 15 seconds per segment. We don't really need to worry about that though because in the end, we can just break the exports into 15 second chunks. So no need to be restrained by the 15 seconds. Just do your thing and we'll see how long it comes to in the end. Step three, exporting. Once you're all finalized with your edit, we need to export. But first you wanna do those 15 second intervals. So go from zero seconds to 15, then 15 to 30 for however long your video is, and we'll have that many segments of our final spot. So you wanna make sure that you're exporting 1080 by 1920. These are the same sequence settings that we used to build out the video, and you wanna make sure the exports go that way too. So you have your 1080 by 1920 vertical videos in 15 second chunks, and then you just wanna text them or send them over to your phone and throw them up on Instagram. Thanks for coming out here. I wanna see your Instagram stories. Hit me up at Kellen Rec on Instagram. Show me what you're making and we'll check back in the next one. Thanks guys, have a good one.